Hello everyone. First of all, thank you so much for clicking on this video and for listening to uh, what I'm about to say here. Uh, I'm not going to, this introduction is very necessary, but it's, it's going to be very short, okay? So stay with me all the way till the end uh, of this video, if you will, please. I was uh, searching the life of a man who predicted the assassination uh, of, you know, our former president Trump. And uh, it's been all over social media and on YouTube and every, everywhere else. So I uh, didn't bring it right away, this information, because I wanted to kind of study and see who this person actually was. And it turns out um, he, I, I really do feel he's, um, prophecy is from the Lord. Okay. So first of all, he prophesied uh, that Trump would get shot and then go right through on the right side uh, of his year. Okay. Which happened. And he prophesied this uh, back in uh, March uh, 15th. Okay. So uh, what is this today? 15. Okay. So exactly uh, four months ago. Okay. He predicted this. I do believe that God raises up prophets, okay, to show us uh, what's going to take place uh, in such a time as this, okay? I truly, strongly believe that. So without further ado, let's listen to what uh, pastor, his name is uh, uh, Brandon uh, Biggs, okay? So he's a pastor and it's uh, Brandon Biggs is his name, all right? So without further ado, let's go take a listen here. So whenever I saw Trump and I saw the I saw a, a red wave coming out of um, Michigan and then I saw Oklahoma and there was embers of people and they were all on um, these these they had torches all throughout Oklahoma and they were raising up these torches that looked like fire and they were bringing forth a new patriotism upon the nation and it was coming it was being birthed and it just kept spreading like fire all throughout America all throughout and I saw Trump rising Amen. up and then I saw an attempt on his life uh that the, this bullet flew by his ear and it came so close to his head that it busted his drum eardrum and i saw um he was he fell to his knees during this time frame and he started worshiping the lord he got radically born again during this time Amen. frame i'm talking Hallelujah. people say he's saved now but he becomes really on fire for jesus for what i saw coming and um then i saw people interceding when he and i see him i saw him winning the the presidency uh through great uh the Lord showed me it would go clear into the, the summer. Great persecution would come on him through the judges and through the um, through that. the law and all these people trying to sue him and all this stuff. But there would be a stop to it. And there things would start to, to, to break free, come toward the fall. And then I saw him winning uh, the election uh, through uh, the patriots coming out and voting. Amen. Okay, so we see here that uh, he predicts this before it ever happened. Right. And one of the things that the Bible says that to see if the uh, prophecy is true is to pray. Right. And to see if it comes into fruition. And so uh, Pastor Brendan Biggs has other prophecies. And I was looking uh, to make sure that I, I brought the right information to you guys. That he has prophecy that has been fulfilled. OK. From the past. Um, and so I just want to say that this is, you know, God really showing that he's not done with America. Uh, yes, there will be tough times and, and uh, there requires a lot of times uh, blood, right? Sacri uh, blood, a blood sacrifice uh, in this uh, spiritual realm, in the kingdom, in order for there to be a shift, a shaking in the spiritual realm, right? Uh, and this is what we're seeing uh, here, okay? Yeah, I truly believe this. Uh, let me know your guys' thoughts in the comment section. Uh, please, please hit the like button. Uh, follow uh, if you have not done so. And uh, click the notification button so you're notified every time a new video is up. Okay? Thanks again for watching. Again, I'm going to read the comment section. Let me know your thoughts and share with someone. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.